Hey guys, what's going on? So, my honest thoughts on the brand new Tarkov Wipe. A lot has changed, and is it for the better, or is it for the is it is it not as be, as good as before? Um, in the background, there is a scav run that I am running. So, but let's get back into a, what has changed and my honest thoughts about this season so far. So, my biggest thing are looking for these noodles. Um, I've played for about 15 hours and I found one noodle. I have found one packet of noodles in 15 hours of gameplay. I think I'm level 12 or level 10. No, I'm about to be level 12. I'm just under level 11. Um, I'm about 25 experience off level 12. So I'm, I'm 15 hours in. Um, still haven't found a Salawa. Uh, I still haven't found a packet of noodles. Well, I actually find one in this scav run. Um, and that's my first one. But I think they should be increasing the rate of them early on. Uh, especially in that Ground Zero map. The Ground Zero map, I'll, I'll get into that in a bit. Um, but yeah, the Salawas, I feel like they're not spawning at the moment. And the noodles, I can't find them anywhere. But let's get into Ground Zero. Ground Zero, it's a fun map, but it's not a friendly map. It was implemented into the game to make life for, you know, beginners and people who are getting into the game easier. Well, I think it made it harder because people are now just camping, camping quests on that map because you can't progress unless you... You actually complete those first four quests you can't progress to get those other quests on other maps so i guess it's the most important thing to do those four quests i think right now it's going to be really difficult and painful to play but i think in i don't know a day or so of the game being actually out and released uh i think it will slow down and it will become a lot more friendly to play but for those early wipes Everyone is playing it, and people are camping extracts, and people are camping the quests, especially the when you get to a wine quest. I, that was very difficult for me because I came across four raids where I found a team camping the wine cellars, so you couldn't get that wine cellar. And you'd come in half, like you'd come in with some decent gear early on because you know you got your M4s, you got your MRDs, you know, you're coming in with those, and then you've got a team of guys waiting for you. Um, to just pretty much take your loot. <laughs> um, that's where I found that Ground Zero is a bit, um, bit how you going. But I, I, I think it is a good map, and there, it is, it is a step in the right direction. Um, I, the one thing I'm that I do recommend if you are playing Ground Zero, you do go in with a team if you have a team. If you have a team of guys, it makes it a lot easier. But yeah, Ground Zero is a bit how you going. I think there's going to be a couple more quests throughout um, between, I think, because it goes to level 20. So 1 to 20, you're allowed in there. I think there'll be one or two more quests um, to actually go le in there, but I haven't got them yet as of... But let's see what happens. Now, the plate system. Now, the plate system is hard to tell because everyone is using low ammo bullet like low penetration bullets no one's got that top tier loot uh top tier looting bullets like you don't have those high tier bullets so i don't know how it's gonna go but it feels like all the really good art like the really good armor like the slicks the hex grids are now not as good as you know some of the other items that some of the other items the armors that are not as good like i see i'm i see a lot of people saying that you know the other weapons are so much the other armors are so much better because they cover your whole body and you can put plates in it i have i honestly haven't reused the plate i found some in raid and i've poured them out but i've never actually had to insert a new plate i just repair my armor like before so i don't really know how it's going to impact the game i think it's a more later i think it's for something more later on uh where it's going to impact the game a little bit more um but let's wait and see i think it's it's something good um that they've implemented it's a little bit more complex now a little bit more depth into the game as well which is always good but yeah questing at the moment is pretty fun um it's normal Tarkov wipe. I have come across a couple of hackers, which I am not really... 
you come across a hacker, you come across a hacker. You're... So, for example, what happened with us, I was in a five-man squad, and we went into factory to uh, do the director's one. Uh, I forgot the quest extortionist, I think it is, the quest extortionist. So five of us went in, and we came in like we, sh- we came in with decent gear, like nothing special, you know, just factory. We're gonna kill some scavs and you know do the do the raid and get and do the the quest. Since there's a, there's five of us, it makes it a little bit easier on factory just to do those quests. Come in, one guy one taps all five of us in the head with a pistol. So it was a it was a very uh, interesting moment. Um, but that's the only hacker that I've come across so far in this wipe. He was EOD, which was pretty sad. Because, um, yeah, he literally, five shots, five kills. He one-tapped all of us head eyes uh, and head jaw. Uh, that's what I've noticed. The recoil is a lot, is different as well. The new recoil system, I feel that it's reverse. So your first shot is now more accurate than before you'd shoot your first shot and it would go up and then you'd slowly take on the the recoil system and go from there but now with the recoil system your first shot is a lot more accurate and with that being said i feel that i get a lot more of my first shots hit um but yeah i I, i'm liking that um it's a good a good change i feel that a lot of guns it's going to change up the gun meta a lot I feel like the AK's going off my intake. The AK is going to become a lot better um, early on as well. See that? See here? I just found my first packet of noodles ever in 15 hours of gameplay. So, yeah, I think they need to definitely increase that spawn. Um, what else do I feel? I feel that um, they've made a lot of good changes in the sense of game time, like I feel like I'm getting into games a lot quicker, uh, last night when I was playing at like 2am, uh, the servers had a little bit of issues, uh, so I'm in Oce- Oceanic servers, so the Australian servers all went down, um, for about a couple of, couple of raids, and then I ended up going to bed because it wasn't fixed by the time I, you know, it was 2 a.m. I was like, all right, time to go to bed. You know, the raids are not working because I was getting some high ping and some high issues there. But yeah, guys, um, what do you guys think? Are you guys playing Tarkov at the moment? Like, I, how are you guys finding the new wipe? Have you guys found the Solowars? Are you guys finding packets and noodles? Am I just looking in the wrong spot? Guys, let me know in the comments below if you've made it this far. Um, and thanks, guys. Have a great day. And see you in the in Tarkov.